everyone. Welcome back to the channel. Today's video, I have something different for you. I have a yard sale thrift haul for you. Um, I went to a couple sales last week and I'm just now getting around to doing the thrift haul videos. <laughs> so um, I went to an estate sale and before the estate sale, I saw that there were a couple um, yard sales uh, right nearby me. So I went to those and then after those, I shot out to the estate sale. So after this video, I'll be recording the estate sale um, haul video for you as well. So let's get into this, um, this thrift haul. Um, at this uh, sale, I spent $20 and I got a bunch of um, primitive items. I know there's a lot of people that like primitive um, items. Uh, so I'm, that's what I'm calling them. I'm calling them primitive uh, slash rustic. So I got this set of three. Um, this one is missing the little handle on it, but that's an easy fix. I can get up some wire and put it in there and make a handle. Um, but it is a lard tin. There's the top for decorative purposes only. That's what it says on the bottom. So we have lard. Then we have baking soda. Baking powder, not baking soda, baking powder. And this one is baking soda. So these are very cute uh, to put in a rustic farmhouse, um, you know, primitive kitchen. So I got the set of three of those. I also got this set of three uh, boxes. Look how cute these are. Primitive Blessings. Aren't these cute? They're so cute. I love them. 1827. Yeah. Oops, wait. There's a string on there. Let me get that off. 1827. So you could use these for storage and decor. I thought these were really, really nice. I'm going to set these back here. As well as... These, these little tins I can just stack inside one another for shipping. Okay, put those back there too. Um, then I got three clocks. Love this one, the big one. Um, this would actually go in my bedroom. I'm debating on whether or not I want to keep it. But they're all battery operated and they all work. I just put batteries in all of them. Look how pretty this one is. This is the, like the color of my bedroom walls. I love it. Isn't it pretty? So I got that. Then I got this black one. And I should have brought my black light because I have a feeling that these hands um, probably glow. So I got that one. And I got this one. This one is more of a sage green, where the other one is more of a blue, like a gray blue. How cute are these little clocks? They're adorable. I also got this awesome cutting board. Look at the size of this guy. That's like an inch and a half thick, for goodness sakes. It's got a, a hanger if you wanted to hang it up. So I don't know if I'm going to do anything with this or not, or just sell it the way it is. I'm. It depends if, you know, anybody wants it, you know. 
So that's a nice cutting board for sure. Then I got this bottle. Um, I'm going to upcycle it. Um, I'm, I'm thinking of something for Halloween. So that was why I bought this one. And I, I don't, I don't think I have a cork to fit this, but I can get corks on Amazon. So I got that. You can go back there too. Um, I got this really nice, um, shelf. It's already like distressed and everything for that rustic feel that has these little hangers on the back. Um, you can put anything on here. You could put anything. You, you could put a potted plant. You could put a candle. You could put a figurine, a vase of flowers. I mean, anything. And it's a, it's a, a neutral color. So it'll go with everything. So I got that. Then I got this. I love this. And it has a little door on the back. How cute is that? I'll show you guys. Hold on. <laughs> Look at this birdhouse. Isn't it adorable? This is wood, but this is um, metal. And then it's got a little door on the back for to clean it out isn't that cute yes got that and the last item i got for my 20 dollars is this cute little birdhouse it's got a galvanized metal um roof it is so cute so i picked that up so that this this little thrift haul is for my rustic people or my primitive people. I find, finally found some primitive items. All right, twenty dollars. I got all that, so that was fantastic. Okay, now. So this was the sale I was originally going to, and then it just so happened that the lady across the alley from her was also having a sale. Like, oh, good, it's a twofer. So, let me show you what I got at this sale. Okay. First, I got this gorgeous, um, elegant depression tidbit tray. Now, I did not look up this pattern, although I did see this pattern in my book the other day when I was looking up the um, bonbon dish that I had. Um, this is gorgeous, perfect condition, no chips, cracks, or flea bites. It's beautiful. Then I got a 19 piece set of Fiesta wear. Yes, I did. Yes, I did. So let's start with, let me show you the bottom. This is the Gravy Boat. Love this color of Fiesta Wear. This color and the, um, the yellow, I love the yellow. So we've got the Gravy Boat. And let me tell you, these are all in perfect condition. Not a thing wrong with any of the pieces. Then we have the Creamer and the Sugar. We have the butter dish. There are four bowls. These would be, I guess, cereal bowls, soup bowls. Got four of those. We got two cups and saucers. 
So it's not a full set, but that's all right. That's okay. Okay, let me put these like this so I have room. Then there are, I have to wash these guys. Then there are two um, dessert or salad plates. Now this has a different mark on the bottom. So they were probably pieced, the set was probably pieced together. And then we have two dinner plates. It's got the same mark as the, um, the salad plates. Two dinner plates and a platter. Now this is not Fiesta, this is made by Gibson, but it does go, it really does go. So yeah, this is, she just threw this in there because it matched all of the others. And it really does, look at, it really does match well. So, got that. All right, I'm just kind of stacking these. I gotta go put those in the dishwasher. Um, I did get um, a vintage Zenith clock radio. Um, the radio works. However, I can't get the clock part to work. It's, it, it's, it probably needs to be cleaned. And I hear something moving around inside. I'm not able to move this dial to change the clock. So I don't know if I'm going to put a little bit of WD-40 in there and see if that helps at all. But I picked it up. When I asked her if it worked, she said, yeah. And I meant like, does everything work on it? But I guess I should have, I should have plugged it in and tried it out. My bad, you know, but you know, we'll see. We'll see if I can get it going. So, um, I mean, it's, 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 Got wear for sure, but you know, this is going back to like the 70s, so it's going to have wear. So I got that. And I'm going to set this right down here. Ugh. And I got two more pieces. And what did I spend here? I think it was $26. I got... This is uh, made in Italy. Um, I have to clean it. Look at this. Ooh, doggy. There's the sticker. Look at how beautiful that is. There's the sticker. That's purdy. This reminds me of Murano. And then I got this. This also reminds me of Murano because I did have a piece of something uh, similar with the similar base um, that was Murano, but uh, I can't say 100% that it is. But isn't that lovely? Mm -hmm. That is very lovely. So I picked that up. And that is it, everybody. That was $26 worth of goodies. Uh, I think I did pretty well. Absolutely. So... Let me know what you think of these two yard sale thrift hauls. Uh, I'm looking forward to going to more um, yard sales and estate sales. I mean, church rummage sales, those will all be coming up too. I mean, you can't beat the prices at those type of sales. You really can't. Um, if, I, if this was at Goodwill, they probably would have had a $15 price tag on it. You know what I mean? So, uh, the Goodwill and Salvation Army prices have gone, like, through the roof. 
Um, so I've kind of had to raise my prices somewhat because of that, if, if I still want to make some kind of a profit, you know? So, I mean, that's why I'm really glad it's the season now for yard sales and, you know, flea markets and all that kind of stuff. So hopefully I can find some great items. All right, everybody, that's going to do it for this thrift haul video. If you liked it, hit the thumbs up, leave me a comment, subscribe if you're not, and share. Sharing is caring. <laughs> All right, guys, I will catch you in my next video. Bye for now.